Located 40 kilometers from Chennai in New Gumidipundi is the Greenfield Thermax Technology Plant of Suryadev. Primarily a manufacturer of the revolutionary QSD rebars, Suryadev recently set up a captive power plant within the same premises. Suryadev was uh, established in 2006 with a view to produce uh, high quality steel at a lower cost of production and uh, we installed the latest technology by going in for a most modern technology mill and the German based thermax quenching technology. Our rebar came into the markets in late 2008 and we were able to achieve the best quality rebar in the Tamil Nadu market. Late 2008, we were badly hit by a power shortage, acute power shortage in Tamil Nadu that led to dramatic fall in our production quantity. So we decided to go in for a captive power plant and the first plant got commissioned in first week of April and the second plant is commissioned very recently. So this, this will help us to use power ourselves and as well as we can supply powers to other captive users, HD users at a competitive price. We have 300 employees in our staff, the power plant. We provide boarding and transport to the employees. We also provide group insurance to our employees. We, we provide indirect employment to nearly 1,000 families in our locality by, by various uh, contra contract obligations. The plant is spread out over an area of more than 50 acres and is functional 24-7 all year round. A typical day at the plant starts with the two most crucial elements, coal and water. Bore water stored in tanks of capacity 1,500 meter cubed is subject to multiple filtration processes at the water treatment plant. Per hour, 54 meter cubed of raw water is pumped in, which produces 30 meter cubed of highly purified water. This water is then sent to the boiler where thermal energy extracted by burning coal will raise it to steam and run the turbines. There is no wastage of water through this process as excess water is recycled and used for watering the green cover in the area, thereby making it a zero discharge plant. Part of our environment program, we have 30 acres earmarked for greenery. We have already uh, uh, planted 3,000 plants and our success rate so far is 90% in the saplings. We have a zero discharge program whereby the recycled water is used to, and the last leg of the water is used for greenery. We also have an integrated rainwater harvesting scheme where the excess water during the rain is collected in the pond and which is we plan to use so that the water usage from the ground is minimized. The coal handling plant at Suryadev is the second largest in South Asia in a 110 by 210 meter coal shed. It can store coal of up to around 85,000 tons. 85 to 90,000 tons coal can be stored and this is totally covered. So the plant is totally free from pollution. Medium ash content coal, imported from Indonesia, is used here. Coal is stocked and fed with a stacker and reclaimer in the shed. The coal is carried to boiler silos through a primary and secondary crusher, where it is broken down to a size of less than 6 mm. The coal is then conveyed to the boiler by means of a covered channel in order to minimize pollution. The plant has two circulating fluidized bed combustion high-pressure top-supported water wall tube boilers 
which give an efficiency of 85%. Superheated steam is produced at 96 atta at 540 degrees Celsius and generates power by two 80 megawatt steam turbo generating sets from BHEL. The steam turbine is operated at 3000 RPM by India's first fully automated METSO DNA DCS control system. The boiler is equipped with electrostatic precipitators with five field arrangements in order to comply with the Tamil Nadu Pollution Control Board norms of 50 ppm as suspended particulate matter. The flue gas is delivered through high-capacity ID fans to a 140-meter-high RCC chimney made by Satyapal. Ash handling plant is supplied by Mekavar BK, one of the pioneers in this field. And uh, we have an intermediate silo where the total bed ash is drained and taken through the intermediate silo. There we have a screening and magnetic separator where the iron content from the ash is separated so that the boiler tubes are not damaged. So that's how and uh, this ash is then uh, conveyed through the dense pipeline system. The, it's uh, free from pollution, totally free from pollution, the latest technology. We produce power at 11,000 kV volt, 11,000 volts, that is 11 kV volt and that is stepped up to 230 kV volt and is transfer, transmitted to the grid. The reason for step, uh, stepping up to 230 kV is when we wheel this power to other captive users, the wheeling loss, the transmission losses are very minimal when compared to stepping up to 110 or 33 kV. So that was the reason for mainly stepping up from 11 to 230 kV grid. The low pressure steam from the turbine is passed to the air cooled condenser supplied and constructed by GIA. Finned tubes carry in the steam, which is converted back to water. The air cooled condenser minimizes the use of water to a great extent. At Suryadev, the plant load factor has consistently been over 100%. Wastage through this entire process is negligible the loss of ignition, which is the unburnt carbon in the flue gas, being less than 2%. What makes this power plant a cut above the rest is the top-notch equipment and state-of-the-art systems that are built to meet global standards. Boiler from Thermax, one of the best. It's a Babcock and Wilcox technology, USA-based technology, and they are the franchisee for the technology in India. And uh, we have chosen generator and turbine from BHL, the best in India today, BHL. They don't compromise on the quality. And the system, the supply, the, it's a totally automated system supplied by the latest technology with DC, uh, digital control, uh, METSO based system. And the boilers also, it's been totally operated by Yoko, Japanese make Yokogawa system. It's a digitally controlled system and it's totally automated. Then regarding the switchyard and HT product, high tensile products, all the tra HT transformers have been procured from Alstom. The switchyard has been designed by them and it is totally automated. And the low tensile transformers have been transfer have been supplied by uh, Voltamps. They are also one of the leading uh, manufacturers in India today. And the switch gears have been supplied by Siemens. Then we have air cooled condenser supplied by GEA, that's a BGR group company, and they are best today in India, uh, which has uh, 112 cells, 112 boiler, 112 tubes, eight cells with 14, uh, 14 cells with eight boiler tubes each, and these are totally protected by high anti corrosive resistant sheetings. So we don't have any issues which gives uh, continuous and efficient, if proper efficiency throughout the running of the plant. Then we have uh, ash handling system supplied by Mikaber as I told you. And we have a coal shed. It's been told by our coal shed supplier that this is probably the second largest coal shed in South Asia. In addition to this, the plant also has unmatched health and safety measures installed 
Safety equipment such as helmets are provided to all employees. The entire coal shed and coal handling system has been equipped with high sensitive fire hydrant system by USHA fire safety equipments. This system is completely computerized and in the event of a power failure automatically switches to a diesel run firefighting system. The success story of Surya Dev doesn't just stop with the effective functioning of the plant but extends to giving back to society and aiding the local people of the region. As part of our CSR activities, we have funded and we continue to fund a number of small schools in the villages nearby for improving their building infrastructure like toilets, classrooms, laboratory facilities and also improve the uh, also in future uh, other schools have approached us and we plan to really fund in around the three villages around the facility. In a short span of time, the staff at the plant have achieved what they set out to do. This is a promise of further expansion and greater things to come. When we faced shortages in power supply on account of power cut imposed by electricity board, Surya Dev came to our rescue and started supplying as group captive consumer power to meet our requirement. We are very much satisfied with the uninterrupted supply of the required power to our plant which facilitates optimum production and honor our commitment to customers with satisfaction. Surya Dev's ultimate goal is to supply consistent, reliable and quality power at a very very competitive price to all our captive users as well as third party users.